In the event of an emergency, there are several types of alarms that will be sounded across the site, and it's important that you're able to recognise what they mean. The major emergency alarm is a wailing siren that sounds like this. It's the signal to go to a refuge area immediately. This is tested each Tuesday at 9.30am. The incident alarm is a series of rapid pips on the Tannoy system. This alarm may sound in conjunction with one of the other alarms and will be followed by a Tannoy message. This alarm is used for a minor incident where only localised plant areas are affected. A warning will be given via a tannoy message and flashing warning lights will be visible for the duration of the incident. A continuous siren warns you of a fire in a process plant. You should leave the area by the safest nearest exit and go to the fire assembly point immediately. You might hear a local fire bell within buildings. The bell will sound like this. The Research and Development Centre have their own system, and this sounds like... If you hear either of these alarms, then leave the building by the safest nearest exit and report immediately to your fire assembly point, where a roll call will be carried out. Familiarise yourself with the blue procedure notices in your area, which tell you where your nearest fire assembly point is situated. Different alarms are used to signify different situations. If you hear the major emergency alarm, go immediately to the nearest refuge area, observing the wind direction. Remember, it's safer to go across wind rather than downwind, so take note of the wind socks. Ensure you have your respirator with you. Alternatively, if you don't, there are stocks held at each refuge area. Once you arrive at the refuge area, register your card at the reader. If you have any difficulty, report to the marshal, who'll be wearing an orange vest. If there's no one at the refuge area location, follow the instructions located in the refuge area. Take a look at your induction booklet to familiarise yourself with the location of all refuge areas, especially in the area where you're going to be working. There are signs like these at each refuge area location. These will be illuminated during the hours of darkness. In the event of a fire, there are some basic rules to remember. On hearing the local fire alarm for your area, stop what you're doing and evacuate by the nearest safe exit. If there's time and no immediate danger, shut any open doors or windows. You then need to report to your nearest fire assembly point. These are shown on the map in your induction booklet. Alternatively, if you discover a fire, then raise the alarm and report this by dialing 3333 from any site telephone. This will contact the gatehouse and a security officer will explain the procedure to follow. Before moving on to the following section, please answer the next set of questions.